Palelo, seven students held up at gunpoint in two separate robberies over the past 24 hours. WLWT News 5's Allison Montoya leading the way live. And Allison, these incidents obviously proving that even going in groups might not be enough. Of course, that's what a lot of students are telling me this afternoon after hearing about these recent attacks on UC students. But we're standing right now in the neighborhood of Fairview and right here in the 400 block of Ada Street. This is where the first incident happened late last night. A lot of residents here are surprised an attack would even happen on this street. Now, Cincinnati police are investigating a robbery in the 400 block of Ada Street near campus. The victim, a student at another university, said a vehicle pulled up to him, a passenger got out, and then he was robbed. At gunpoint. The suspect is described as 17 to 18 years old. The vehicle is an older model white Chevy Malibu with tinted windows. On to the other incident. Another robbery happened earlier this morning, also near UC's campus on Riddle Road near Riddle View. Police say right after midnight, six UC students were robbed at gunpoint. No one was hurt in that incident, and the suspects were eventually tracked down and arrested. So, if you know anything about this latest incident here on Ada Street in Fairview that happened at 9:30 last night, of course, police want you to call them. A lot of students telling me this latest crime on students here around the campus of UC, of course, has them on high alert. Reporting live from Fairview, Allison Montoya, WLWT News 5. There have been a total of eight robberies near campus in just the last three weeks. The first one. Reported uh, was a home invasion that happened on August 21st when school was just about to start. Since then, there have been six street robberies and another home invasion where a woman says that she was sexually assaulted. During that same time, both UC and Cincinnati police have increased patrols surrounding the uptown campus, going from 40 to 64 officers, and the school is in the midst of installing more than 320 new LED lights to make campus streets brighter and safer. 